Hey guys, welcome to another unboxing video. I'm Avery from Alchemy and Vision, and today we are gonna be boxing a mystery deck from Tamed Wild. Now, Tamed Wild um, has a shop. They have a monthly subscription box, so I have some links below if you wanna go check that out. Um, I have no idea what deck this is, so it's a mystery. I don't really have any other information to tell you other than that I have no idea what I'm about to get into, but I am so excited. Shall we begin? I feel like I just need to have scissors on hand every time I do this. Oh my God. Oh, cute. Oh my God. Oh, this is so cool. They gave me a pin. Tamed wild. Let me see. A pin. Time seeds. This is cute. And the Oracle deck we are going to be unboxing today is the Wild Medicine Herbal deck. I don't know what I was expecting, which deck I was expect expecting to receive, but this one is so like out of my comfort zone in such a cool way because I don't know anything about herbs. And so this is going to this is going to be so sick because I'm connecting with my spirituality, I'm connecting with my self-care routine, and I'm connecting with nature. You guys are so sweet. <laughs> this is so special. This is so fun. I love that I had no idea what I was getting, and here I am. All right, let's do this. Okay. Oh my god. Cute. Oh my God. It's so glossy. Okay. Wild Medicine Herbal Deck. In these cards, you will find 33 of the top medicinal herbs. Herbs. Well, I guess in England they say herbs, so I'm not wrong. Historically used for healing. I love this. Each card includes beautifully hand painted art. Common in a botanical name. Wait, is this bulleted or <laughs> is it a sentence? Okay, common in botanical name, plant description, parts used, historical medicinal uses, how to use, and ritual and lore. Oh, this is so fun. I'm stuck. Welcome to the Wild Medicine Herbal Deck created by Tamed Wild Apothecary. They have their own apothecary. This is so cute. This deck contains 33 of the top medicinal herbs used throughout time to heal the body, spirit, and soul. This deck feels so like ancient in the most beautiful way. Our wish is that you may use this deck to inspire, heal, educate, and connect with your roots and nature. We are honored to be a part of your journey. I'm, I'm honored that I'm part of the deck's journey and my, my own journey. Oh, this is upside down. Oh, oh. I guess they all have useful information on them. Tamed Wild Apothecary was founded on the belief in plant medicine. I am a really big advocate for plant medicine. Comment below if you are too. We can use a code word, like just comment a plant emoji if you are too. <laughs> plant medicine to heal not only your body, but your mind and soul as well. We believe in what mother nature has provided us as a useful and effective means to not only survive, but thrive. I love that. Our products are created with intention and with the utmost respect for the plants that contribute to them. We hope you find this deck a useful friend and companion on your journey into wild medicine. I love that. I'll just go through it like this. Mm. The artwork is so pretty. 
It's like, I don't know much about like art mediums, but it looks like it's watercolored. Oof, yes. Like I, I literally know so little about plants that I don't even know what these <laughs> words mean. I mean, I'm probably gonna come across some that I know of or that I'm familiar with or have heard of, but this is so, I feel like I'm gonna learn so much. Hell yeah. Cause like whenever you go on the, whenever you watch those, whenever you go on the survival shows, like it's something we all do for fun. I mean, some of you might, but whenever I watch those shows, oh, peppermint, I know what that is. <laughs> Menta pe peperita. Peperita. Um, I always, the ones who know the plants and the berries and which ones are good, oh, I know what nettle is. They're usually the ones that end up surviving really long because like when meat is scarce or whatever, they know how to scavenge for, oh, mugwort. I've heard a lot about mugwort. Oh, the art is so pretty. Anyway, they know how to scavenge really well for plants. Marshmallow, marshmallow. Oh. The s'mores marshmallows, did they really steal their name from a plant? Cause that's, holy basil, ah, it's holy. Um, anyway, so I feel like me just having this deck, I'm already gonna start being able to know my plants better and be able to, I don't know, ginger thrive in a different way than I was before I got this. <laughs> also, the card stock is really nice. It feels like very matte, but it also feels like um, what is this word called? S not slimy, what the heck? Slick. It feels matte and like the perfect balance of matte and slick. And the size of the card too is, is perfect. I'll shuffle them in a little bit, but I really like the size. And the colors. I've been so attracted to the color green lately. Oh, I love this. Chamomile. Mmm, cayenne, interesting. I think this is the last one. So there's no guidebook to this deck. So I'm not really sure how to, like if I shuffle them, so I'm just gonna shuffle them. Because I'm a tarot reader and my favorite method of like selecting a card is to shuffle until a card falls out or jumps out, I'm just gonna pick which card we are gonna read the back of that way. <laughs> Cause that is the way I know and the way I do every single day. Oh, this one. Okay, German chamomile. German chamomile matricaria recutita, otherwise known as the children's herb. So plant description, delicate small flower with a puffy yellow center and small elongated white petals that grow downward away from the center, can grow six to four inches tall. Parts used, the flower heads. Historical medicinal uses, chamomile, chamomile, oh my god, chamomile has been documented for centuries as a popular herb and bitter for digestive and stomach issues. Oh my god, I need this. I definitely have digestive issues once in a while. That's a big reason why I am a pescatarian. Um, but it's used to stimulate digestion, 
relieve stomach cramps and calm the nerves. This ancient herb's gentle yet effective nature makes it a popular herb for use with children. How to use? You can use it in a tea, in a tincture, infusion, bath soak, or a salve, or salve, however you prefer to say it. Ritual and lore. Egyptians held the chamomile flower in high regard, using the crushed petals as part of their beautifying regime. 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 However you say that word. They dedicated the herb to their sun god, Ra, and believed it brought luck and prosperity. This deck is super cool. I can't wait to utilize this deck and learn so much about medicinal plants. And the artwork is stunning. It's easy to shuffle if that's in fact how you pick plants out <laughs> or how to use it. I'll have to do a little more research on it. Um, but oh my God, thank you so much Tamed Wild. Thank you for the pin. I love that it's like a little crystal ball with a moon and the seeds. I don't currently have any plants in my apartment, but now I will. Thank you so much Tamed Wild for sending me this deck. This was such a surprise and so fun to unbox without knowing what I was about to get into. This is so sick. If you want this deck or another deck by Tamed Wild, I have a link below, an affiliate link. You can use my code. Um, to get a discount, <laughs> so exciting. Um, they, Tamed Wild has so many different decks. They have tarot decks, oracle decks, um, crystals, altar decorations. Yeah, that is all. I will talk to you guys later. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. Don't forget to give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Also, if you haven't followed Alchemy and Visions Instagram, TikTok, or Twitter yet, I have all the links below. I hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye.